For the crime you have committed, I sentence you to 68 years in prison. Your Honour, my client has requested if you could add one more year. If I have to wake up early, then I'm gonna stay up late. If I have something to do, then I'm gonna procrastinate. And if there's work to be done, I'll find other work to do. I'll focus on literally anything but what I'm supposed to. She was so nasty and so rude I that I don't so even, nasty don't ever bring so anybody rude. around me like that. So nasty and that's what happened. so rude. So nasty and so rude. My girlfriend's dog died the other day and she was really depressed. So me being the nice guy I am, I decided to cheer her up. I bought her an identical dog, but it ended up making her even more sad. She screamed at me and said, what the hell am I supposed to do with two dead dogs? Do you want to form an alliance with me? Absolutely, I do. Good. Good. Excellent. Anyone want any muffins? I wouldn't eat those! Could be poisoned. What? Why would they be poisoned? I could ask you the same thing. Are you serious? Did anyone actually see him bake these muffins? Yeah. Did anyone actually see them bake these muffins? I didn't poison the muffin. Oh, and we're just supposed to trust you? Yes. yes. Listen, eat them if you want. <laughs> but is it worth the risk? You just want more muffins for yourself. What? <laughs> Are those crumbs on your top? No! Wait, you already had one? No! You already had one? I had three! And they were delicious! <laughs> we did yeah! Hello. Grandma. What? I want to come to your house, but I can't because my mama said you busy. No, she didn't. Mama, all I said was he does not need to be over there all the time. Girl, don't say shit to me. You are lucky I'm five tequilas in. Otherwise, I come and get him myself. Bring me my grandbaby. But... Lucky! See, cause now we snitching. Ma'am? Go get your bag. Ow! What are all these clocks about? Well, these are lie clocks. Every time you tell a lie in your life, the hands will move. No way! So who's that clock there? That's Mother Teresa's clock. The hands never moved, so she never told a lie. Incredible! And this clock behind me? That's Abe Lincoln's clock. The hands moved twice, so he told two lies in his lifetime. So where's my clock? Ah, your clock is in God's office. He's using it as a ceiling fan. This guy's at a bar having some drinks. All of a sudden, he throws up all over himself. He goes, oh my God, my wife's going to kill me. What do I do? Bartender says, tell you what, take $20, put it in your shirt pocket, tell us someone threw up on your shirt, gave you the money to clean it. Guy says, great idea. Gets in a cab, goes home. Walks in the door, the wife goes, look at you, you're drunk, you're disgusting, you threw up all over yourself. He goes, no, honey, someone threw up on me and put $20 in my shirt pocket to have it cleaned. She goes in his pocket, pulls out the money. She goes, yeah, there's two 20s in here. What's the other one for? He goes, oh, yeah, he also shit in my pants. Do you uh, need a hand taking these fairy lights down? Oh, no, it's fine. I, I put them up myself. Come on, man, don't be too proud. Let me help you. Oh, what? It's, it's so sticky for. Yeah. It smells of shit. Yeah. Ugh. Like I said, I put them up myself. Step on a crack and break your mama's back. Oh, my back. You just broke your mother's back. Step on a block and break your father's car. Hey, how much are the books? Three dollars for one book or ten dollars for three. Here's three dollars. Give me one book. Okay. Wait. Here's three dollars. Give me another one. Here you go. Here's another three dollars. Give me one more. Thank you. I just bought three books for nine dollars. Are you dumb? I'm about to end this guy's whole career. This makes everybody buy three books instead of one. Oh, great heavens! You can't get infinite wishes? Easy. Yo, Simon and Genie, I'll grant you two wishes. But no wishing from your wishes and no wishing from your genies. Now, what will it be? I simply just wish for a notebook and a pencil. Hmm. Fine. Granted. But I'm not going to let you just write anything you want down in the notebook and then wish for everything in the notebook to come true. What? No, I wasn't going to wish for anything like that. That's just mean. I wish for the superpower to be able to draw anything I want in the notebook and for that drawing to come to life. Oh, yeah, that's a pretty cool wish, actually. <laughs> Granted. So tell me, what's the first thing you're going to draw? Well, if you must know, I'm going to draw a genie. Oh, 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 You want to see a magic trick? Please don't steal my wallet. I'm not going to steal your wallet this time. 
That's what you said last time, and then you stole my wallet. What'd you do? Your mom is pregnant. That snap did not just get my mom pregnant. Nine months. You do not know a magic trick that gets my mom nine months pregnant. The baby comes out and it's just garlic. Did you just say the baby was garlic? Dude, there's a... Hey, Mom. Listen, Timothy, I do not know what the fuck is going on. Yo, son, you should study more. But why? So you can get good grades. Then what? You'll get a good paying job. Then? You'll get a big house, a nice car, and have a better life. Okay, then? And then you'll be able to relax. What do you think I'm doing right now? Oh, great heavens! Step on a crack and break your mama's back. Oh, my back. You just broke your mother's back. Step on a... Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hold it there. I know what you were going to do. You were going to step on a brick. But I'm five steps ahead of you. Step on some grass and destroy your nephew's ass. Damn, I only have 20 minutes until I want to go to bed. Definitely not enough time to watch a TV show. I guess I'll just scroll on my phone for three hours instead. Okay, Jack, so how are you finding the medication? Yeah, pretty, pretty good. Do you feel more independent? Yeah. Did your imaginary friend just tell you to say that? No. I'm going to up your prescription a little that bit. That seems fair. So you're going to want to up it to about four tablets per day. You want to make sure that you've eaten just before uh, you, you take your, your pills, I'd say. It's a hey Siri, I just lost my job. Can you tell me a joke to cheer me up? What's the difference between you and a large pizza? I don't know. What? A large pizza can feed a family. What did she say? Yo, did you hear that Will Ferrell's out of jail? Oh, I didn't even know he went to jail. Will Ferrell went to jail? I thought you just said that. No, I said he's out of jail, so he never went to jail. Why the fuck would Will Ferrell go to jail? I don't know. I thought you just implied that. You're just saying he's out of jail and he never went to jail? That's what out of jail means. He's not in jail. Dumbass. Whatever, dude. I'm gonna order some McDonald's. Do you want anything? Ooh, yeah. Can I get a burger with no blueberries? Blueberries? No, thanks. No, I, why would someone want blueberries on their burger? Why would you ask me? I literally just said no blueberries. But why would there be blueberries on the burger? I don't know, dude. That sounds gross as fuck. There are no blueberries on their burgers. Then what's the problem? There's no problem. Oh, my God. Dumbass. Okay, it's asking if you want to donate $2 to testicular cancer research. Oh, yeah, man. My mom survived that. Your mom doesn't have testicles. No shit, Sherlock. That's how she survived it. Dumbass. How am I the dumbass? Hello. Welcome to heaven. Hello. Tell me, what was your worst scene? Um, I blew bubbles. What? That's not a scene. You can come inside. Next. Hi. What was your worst scene? I also blew bubbles. Still not a scene. Come inside. Next. Hi, I'm Jack, but people call me Bubbles. Mom, look what I can do. No, Timmy, please don't. Step on a crack and break your mama's... Whoa! Oh, 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 my back. Oh, my gosh. You just broke your back. Don't just stand there. Help me. Step on a crack and break your mama's back. Mom, hurry up, call them. Hey, 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 where are you going? Mom, you wouldn't leave me on the road like that. You wouldn't leave your only son with a broken back on the road like that. You wouldn't. No way, huh? No, 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 no. You wouldn't do that, right? Hello, I'm from Would You Abandon Your Child? I don't know who needs to hear this, but if I say huh like six times, please don't say never mind. Don't, 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 don't give up on me. I'm trying my best. This little boy has this toy airplane that he loves to play with. He's in the living room playing with it. His mother's in the kitchen listening to him. And she hears him go, vroom, vroom, vroom. All you motherfucking people who want to get on, get on. All you motherfucking people who want to get off, get off. The mother, very angry, runs out, grabs the plane, and sends the kid upstairs to his room. 
About 15 minutes later, she goes back upstairs and she looks at him and she says, all right, listen, you can play with the plane if you don't use that foul language. Kid agrees. Goes back into the living room. Mom goes back into the kitchen. Mom listens. Vroom, vroom. All you wonderful people who want to get on, get on. All you wonderful people who want to get off, please get off. And if you have a problem with the 15 minute delay, you can go talk to that fucking bitch in the kitchen. Hi, excuse me. Um, do you sell bouquets for children? You're not a paedophile though, right? What? No, they're for my girlfriends. This is a kid. Hmm. Uh, girlfriend's kid. She likes flowers, so. Two lips. I, yeah, why wouldn't she? She had two eyes and her nose as well. Uh, she exists. <laughs> well, that, that's good. Uh, but I, I meant like, what do you want? Um, like two lips, orchids? You know, oh, well, I'll take the kids. Oh, I forgot the bananas. I'll be right back, okay? Okay, whatever. <gasps> Wait, mommy, don't leave me! Sorry about that. <sighs> Alexa, find me a movie. Who is Alexa? Sorry, I meant Siri. Who is Alexa? Please find me a movie. Why don't you ask that bitch Alexa to find you a movie? Hey, thanks for dining with us. Uh, it is Tuesday, so kids eat free today. Huh? Oh, wow, that's amazing. Oh, wow. Sure is. So what can I get for you? Well, I'm not really that hungry, so I'm just gonna have a water. Okay. Uh, what about you, Derek? I'm gonna start off with the chicken tenders and the french fries. And I'll have the T-bone steak. Medium well. Loaded baked potato, cornbread, and the quarters light. And then that's everything. Mommy, why is some of your hair white? Mm, because every time you make me sad, one hair turns white. Oh really mommy? So what did you do to grandma? Oh my god dad, I'm gonna be in a Mr. Beast video! Oh my god, that's very good, so that means you're gonna be rich! About that, he will only give me money if I do exactly as he says. Okay, so do whatever he wants. Okay, this is um, Mr. Beast? Hello, this is Yahya with Yes me. it is! Okay, if you do all four of these challenges, you will win the grand prize of one million dollars. Oh my god! What did he say? He said I will win one million dollars! Okay, what do you want to do, Mr. Beast? For your first challenge, I want you to tell your dad that you love him. Oh, that's easy. I love you, dad. Oh, he seems like a good person. Now, I want you to punch him. What? If you want to win a million dollars, you have to punch your dad in the face. What did he say? He said I have to punch you. Do it. What? No. Yeah, hey, this is one million dollars. You know how much this money can help. Now do it. Oh my god. Ah! Oh, it's worth it. It's worth it. Okay, what well, now? Now for the third challenge, we cut out all water and food sources from you guys. Whoever survives the longest will be the winner of the one million dollars. Sexy Carmo. Who the fuck is this? Hello? Yo, what's good? Let me talk to Keisha. You wanna talk to Keisha? Bro, who's you? What you mean, who's me? I'm Tyrone. I'm Keisha's man. Keisha's man? Bro, I'm her husband. Husband? I've been with Keisha for like eight months, homie. What? That's my wife of five years, homie. Oh, hell nah. Yo, when you talk to Keisha, let her know I ain't paying half that rent no more. I ain't paying for that car note. I'm cutting the fucking Netflix off. And she can forget about that grocery money I've been giving her every week. Wait, you do all that shit? Yo, homie, I was just playing, man. I'm actually Keisha's cousin. So as soon as she gets back in, man, I'm gonna let her know you called, all right? Don't got me fucked up. We almost lost a good one. If a tomato is technically a fruit, then that would make ketchup a smoothie. Until we meet again! I think we should get a divorce. What are you doing? Just practicing.
Uh, why are you already planning your hypothetical divorce? I don't know. I'm 22. I think I'm having a quarter life crisis. You don't even have a girlfriend. Hypothetically divorce me. Okay, then I'm hypothetically taking half of your assets. Well, you didn't sign the hypothetical prenup. Is it? It's called a prenup, right? Yeah, it's a prenup, and you did hypothetically sign one, so. Who the fuck is this guy? I'm his hypothetical lawyer in this divorce case. Well, then I'm taking the hypothetical kids, so, right? We can get those, right? Yes, we can definitely get the hypothetical kids. Don't worry about it. Who the fuck is this hypothetical nerd? Fucking idiot, glass-wearing nerd. Wow, that is a lot of... Hypothetical insults. This is my hypothetical lawyer, and we have been hypothetically sleeping with each other, so. <laughs> how could you hypothetically- mm, mm. How could you hypothetically do this to me? Because you <laughs> hypothetically are an alcoholic, so. Your mother told me that you got kicked out of school again. Yeah, I got in a fight with some kid because he stole my things. Fuck. Did you win, at least? Yeah, I wiped the floor with him. I, I even went and kissed the girl he had a crush on afterwards. Brad, we've spoken about this before! You have to focus on your work. Girls, Girls come second. Come second I, I know. Good. Now, come on. Let's find you another job. I didn't even like being a janitor anyway. Hey, Mom, do you know where my Neil deGrasse Tyson action Wait, hold, hold on. <laughs> what is that? Oh, oh, my God. Is that you? No, no I, I don't Dear think God, so. Dear God, go, go take a shower. Go, 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 go. Uh, do okay, something yeah. other than that's be fine. here that's right fine. now. Hey, dude. Wanna play a uh, naked twister again? What the yeah. hell? I, I guess that's a no. No, no, no not uh, that. What? What is that smell? Oh my god! If that's you, if that's you, don't come back. It's not, like, it's not just, me. just go away. It's and don't come. Back. Hey, mom. Notice anything new about me today? Oh! It's even worse now. Leave! 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 Past the edge of your naked eye visibility existence, but. Do you smell that? It might be you. If we consider the sense Okay, they're ready for you. Are you sure you can do this? Uh, yeah, I don't get nervous. I just imagine the crowd naked. Evan, this is a support group for families who have lost a loved one through unaliving themselves. Please don't do that. That's why I've prepared a few jokes. Please don't tell any jokes. Right, smart, smart. Yeah. Thank you. Go on, they're waiting for you. Right, yep. Yeah. Okay. <clears throat> hey guys, how's it hanging? <gasps> um, yeah, this shit good as fuck, bro. This shit great. Hey, I'm glad you like it, bro. Now we're gonna have you try the next sample. Okay. What's different with this one? This next sample is from a female cow. Then what was the first one? The first sample was from a male cow. Male cows don't produce milk. They don't even have udders. Yeah, bro. We uh, we already know that. What was in that cup? Trust me, bro. You don't, you don't Yo, want to know, bro. What was in that cup, bro? What did you make me drink? Let's just continue with the next cup. one, bro. Forget about You will never, ever get away with it. Okay, um, let's wrap this up. Uh, I made reservations at Applebee's. Dude, that's my window. Let him go. Killed him. My window, yo. We have a front door, man. Why did you kill him? That window gonna cost me a lot of money. Did you even go over your evil plan? No. It's none of y'all damn business. Excuse me. Can somebody get me an estimate on this, please? Are, are you new to this? You're supposed to go over your evil plan with him, which then gives me enough time to swoop in and save him. That's evil villain 101. Can someone call Frank, please, to fix this window? You are going to pay for this. Damn window. Hey, I've got your results back. Break it to me gently. Uh, okay, um, what is your star sign? Star sign? Um, uh, cancer. Cancer? Well, that is a coincidence. Why is it? Because I'm a cancer as well. Oh, I, well, yeah, that is a bit of a... But I'm not dying of AIDS, so... Chicken farmer walks into a bar, sits down, orders a glass of champagne. There's a woman sitting next to him. She goes, oh my goodness, I ordered a glass of champagne too. And he goes, what a coincidence. This is a very special day for me. I'm celebrating. She goes, what a coincidence. So am I. He says, what are you celebrating? She goes, well, for years my husband and I couldn't have children. And I found out today I'm pregnant. And he goes, that's amazing. She goes, well, what are you celebrating? He goes, well... For the last six months, my chickens have been laying infertile eggs. And today, 
all their eggs are fertilized. She goes, oh, that's amazing. How did your chicken's eggs get fertilized? And he goes, well, I used a different cock. And she looks at him and goes, what a coincidence. Oh, my mom's calling me right now. Hello? Where the fuck are you? Oh, I'm at my friend's house right now. Get your ass home now. Okay, okay. I'm coming home right now. Is that your mom? Yeah, bro. Tell her I said hi, bro. Oh, Ding said hi. Fuck Ding. Come home now. I'm beating that ass when you get home. I should have not eaten those three plates of beans at work tonight. Hey, hon. I have a surprise for dinner tonight, but you got to put the blindfold on. Um, okay. Uh. Okay, just follow my hand. Okay. Okay, sit down right here and take them off. Hold on, don't peek. No, I won't peek. Oh, my stomach. Oh. Oh, my. I should not have eaten those beans. Oh, God. Oh, my God. Okay, sorry. Did you peek? I didn't peek. Okay, take them off. Take them off? Okay. Happy birthday! Hey, Siri. You gotta stop roasting me. People think you're mean. I'm sorry. There's something I want to say to you. Come closer. Closer. Tell me. Don't be ashamed of who you are. That's your parents' job. Hey, what's up? I can't figure out number four. I keep doing multiplication and it's not working. Uh, number four, you said? Yeah, number four. Ugh. Uh, okay. 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 Um, class. Class, everyone look at me, please. I'm getting a little concerned. Honestly, walking around the room, I've noticed um, some people are doing multiplication for number four. Remember, this is Spanish class. There's no that on this exam. Yes, I'm not being funny. I think your girlfriend's cheating on you. I think you're right. That wasn't very funny. Hey, bro, if you think about it, every mirror that you buy is used. In the past, there is more future than there is now. If you wait on the waiter, then technically you become the waiter. You will never know what your first memory was. Every odd number has the letter E in it. There are words that we haven't invented yet. It is possible that you have already taken a photo that's going to be at your funeral. Pick or be! Trick or treat, he's got a speech impediment. Oh, and what have you come as? I'm a pirate. Pirate. Oh, and where are your buccaneers? My buccaneers are right here. Why don't you use your bucking eyes? Oh! Relax. I just want to take some pictures. 911, what's your emergency? <laughs> Hello? Is anyone there? Hi, right, can I? <laughs> <laughs> no, nah, I can't. I can't do it, bro. I can't. Okay, my turn. Give me the phone. Give me the phone. Hello? Mommy, help! What? Who is this? Mama, help me! Oh my God! Timmy? Hurry, mommy! He's gonna find me! Who? Baby, where are you? <laughs> <laughs> hey, what number did you call? Oh, it was just some random number I found on a missing children's poster. Like I got in a lot of numbers on there. Like check this one out. Yellow. Papa. Oh my God! It's been five years. I thought I never was gonna hear from you, son. Where are you? <laughs> You're going to hell. Let's face it. English is a stupid language because if we examine the paradoxes, we find that there's no egg and eggplant, no ham and hamburger, there's no pine or apple in pineapple, English muffins were not invented in England, French fries were not invented in France, quick sand takes you down slowly, boxing rings are square, a guinea pig is neither from guinea or a pig, if writers write, how come fingers don't think? If the plural of tooth is teeth, why isn't the plural of phone booth phone beef? If a vegetarian eats vegetables, what the hell does a humanitarian eat? Why do we recite at a play, but play at a recital? A house is burning up as it burns down and you fill out a form by filling it in a man is drinking at a bar when he notices a beautiful young lady hello what's your name the woman giggles and says hi i'm stacy what's your name my name is billy billy do you want to come over to my house tonight billy gets excited and he says sure let's go later at stacy's house billy notices a picture of a man on stacy's desk and asks her is this your brother stacy giggles and says no it isn't is it your husband? Stacy giggles even more and says, No, silly. Then he must be your boyfriend. Stacy giggles even more while walking towards Billy and says, No, silly, that's not my boyfriend. I'm confused. Who is it? Stacy looks at him, smiles, and says, That's me before the operation. Hey, dude, wanna have a snowball fight? No. Come on, man. I said no. I can't.
10 years ago, my dad and I had a snowball fight. He threw one directly in my eyes and I couldn't see. And while I was down, he ran away. Dad? So I don't do snowball fights much these days. I'm sorry, man. How about we build a snowman instead? Okay, sweet. Grab your coat. Okay. Dad? <laughs> hey, honey. Look what I got for our son. You got him a phone? Hold on, let me get my camera out. But I got this for our son. I know, I want to record you giving it to him. Oh, I don't think you understand. I got this for our son. <gasps> this guy's driving around in the country, and he sees a sign that says, Talking Dog for Sale. So he's a little intrigued. He pulls over, gets out of the car, knocks on the door. Farmer opens the door, lets him in. He walks up to the dog, he says, So, what have you done with your life? And the dog looks at him and says, Well, um... I worked in the Alps for a while, saving avalanche victims. I uh, did a tour of Iraq for my country. And now I just spend my days uh, reading books to the elderly at a retirement home. The guy's amazed. He can't believe this. He runs up to the farmer. He goes, why would you sell a dog like this? And the farmer says, because he's a fucking liar. He's never done any of that shit. Here's your baby, sir. Aw, thank you. Unfortunately, I have some bad news, though. Your wife didn't make it. Then give me the one my wife made. <gasps> Bro, if the number two pencil is the most popular pencil, why is it still number two? Dude, come on. Dude, why does fat chance and slim chance mean the same thing? You gotta be kidding me. Why are there no B batteries? Why do British people never sound British when they sing? Oh, come on! At a movie theater, which armrest is yours? I just want to let you guys know, I think there's a homeless guy outside. He said if I get him a Whopper and a large Dr. Pepper, he'd give me a head. <laughs> I know. I just kind of wanted to report that. Okay, thank you. That's weird. Yeah. Anyways, can I get a Whopper and a large Dr. Pepper? So you got the money? If you want to talk with him, you got to talk with me. Ah, uh, so you're the translator. Ah, uh, eres el traductor. No, tú eres el traductor. No, you're the translator. How am I the translator? Como soy el traductor? ¿Por qué para eso te contrate? Because that's why I hired you. No, motherfucker, I'm here to make a deal. No, hijo de puta, estoy aquí para hacer un trato. ¿Con quién creas que estás hablando? Who do you think you're talking to? If you don't take this serious, I'm gonna blow your head off. Si no te lo tomas en serio, te vuelvo a ver la cabeza. ¿Qué? What? Can I just speak with him alone? ¿Te puedo hablar con él solo? Sí. Yeah. No, I'm asking you to walk away. No, te estoy pidiendo para que te la alejes. Okay, you're the worst translator. Okay, eres el peor traductor. Oh, you're talking about me. Yeah, the deal's off. Si, la ofertas de descuento. Oh shit, I fucked up. Fella gets into a fight with his wife. She kicks him out for the night. So he calls his buddy. His buddy says, yeah, come on over. You could stay with me for the night. So he goes to his buddy's house. They're sitting on the couch. They're having a beer. Guy says, all right, so tell me what happened. He goes, I, I don't know. One minute we're talking about the broken dishwasher, and the next minute she's calling me an arrogant, egotistical, chauvinistic pig. And his buddy says, all right, slow down. Tell me everything that happened from the beginning. He goes, I don't know. I walk in there. She gives me 1200 to buy a new dishwasher, and I hand the money back to her, and I say, you're hired. Afternoon, sir. Do you know this woman? Yes, that's my wife. I don't know how to break it to you, sir, but it looks like your wife got hit by a truck. I know, but she has a wonderful personality. I know, she's dead. She got run over by a truck. Oh, no. She fell asleep on the wheel. Oh. I'm sorry, I'm not sure what happened. She must have gotten... She must have gotten tired. Hey, this party's kind of lame. Do you want to head out? Yeah, let me just say goodbye to everybody first. No, 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 can we not? Let's just... Let's just do an Irish goodbye. Okay, yeah. No, I think I can do an Irish goodbye. <clears throat> Wait, no. Goodbye, everyone. Oh, my God. Goodbye. Why are they all looking at me like that? That was not an Irish goodbye. You're right, I should have done a heel click. No, no, an Irish goodbye is when you leave without saying goodbye. Like my dad. Now, why would I want you to say goodbye in an accent? People love accents. Watch, I'll do a Chinese goodbye. No, hey, no, I am begging you. Oh, what, the, don't lick my hand. What are you, five years old? It tastes like hazelnut. Let's just get out of here, please. Okay, fine, but I gotta, I gotta pee first. All right, just make it quick. Okay, Dad. Go. Oh, right, listen up. Me and the man damn about to leave, but I gotta take a piss first. It's a British goodbye. You need to leave. Do you want spicy? Boss, make me cry. You've been single for two years. Can you find the mountain? Point if you see the mountain. 
Doo doo, help me find a mountain. Doo doo, help me find a mountain. Doo doo, help me find a mountain. Do you see the mountain? Come on, I know you see Bro, the. The mountain is right there. It's right there. Dang. Like, what type of explorer are you? Are you stupid? Oh my God! Keep asking me. Dang! Shut up. Okay. <laughs> well, since you're an explorer, can you help me find your hose? Can you help me find your hose? Cause you're the explorer, so you can probably find them. Where are they? Oh, oh, I know a better one. Can you help me find your dad? Can you? Okay, Dora, come on, let's just. No, 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 Boots. Dora. No, he, he wanna, he the explorer, so let's talk about it. Come, come on, cause that's gonna take us about two seasons to find him. I just bought this thing using my money from my job. Why the fuck are you using your money from your job? To buy you shit. One day, this blind man goes into this local restaurant owned by this husband and wife. He sits down. The guy who owns the restaurant is also the service. So he walks up and he asks the guy if he wants to see a menu. And the guy says, well, I'm blind, but if you bring me a dirty fork, I'll sniff it and then I'll order my food. Waiter's confused, but he goes in the kitchen, gets a dirty fork, brings it to the blind man. The blind man sniffs it and goes, I'll have meatloaf, mashed potatoes and gravy, uh, corn on the cob, and a Coke. Waiter gets it, brings it out to him. Guy eats it, enjoys his meal, pays the bill and leaves. Next week, the guy comes into the restaurant again. Server sees him, thinks ahead, runs into the kitchen, goes up to his wife and he says, Hey, Brenda, take this spoon, rub it all over your private parts. She does it. Waiter brings it out, gives it to the blind man, he takes a whiff and he goes, Oh, I didn't know Brenda worked here. Hey, Mom, let me introduce you to my girlfriend. Hi, it's a pleasure to finally meet you. <sighs> I, you couldn't find anything better? Hey, Mom, leave her alone, all right? I love her. Shut the fuck up! I was talking to her. Hi, I need a job and I see you're hiring. Yeah, do you have any experience? Oh no, uh, I just graduated. Sorry, can't help you. What do you mean? You need experience. But I need a job to get experience. No, you need experience to get a job. That's why I'm here. We have jobs here, not experience. Then where do I get the experience? Go work and you'll get it. How much experience do I need? Ten years. This is an entry-level position, right? Yes, you may enter after working for 10 years. I'm 19 years old! Was I meant to be working since I was 9?! Listen, David, it's Ryan. If you're not gonna come prepared, don't come at all. I think there's an exit-level job down the hall called my door. Bye-bye. Time of death, 11-11. Make a wish. <laughs> <gasps> Holy crap, it worked! Did you wish him back alive? Yeah. You're not supposed to tell anyone. Damn. Hey, Dad, um, Mom just texted me something. What did she say? Tell your dad to clean the house, do the laundry, and get dinner ready before she comes back from shopping. <laughs> well, tell your mother yesterday I did it and today is her turn. Yeah, but I would have thought you guys would have, you know, ordered in or something. Why? Why today? Because it's your anniversary. Happy anniversary, by the way. Oh, you didn't wish her. Oh, she's mad, mad. I'll start with the laundry, you start with the food. Thank you. Beautiful. Language. Pictures. Comfortable. No. To the three people on this flight, this is the captain. The plane is gonna crash. What? Oh dear. I've done all I can, but the plane is going down. There's three parachutes, and as I'm the pilot, I'm taking one. You guys can fight it out who takes the other two. Okay, listen you two. I'm Elon Musk, the smartest man on the planet. Uh, Mr. Musk, humanity can't afford to lose this brain, so I'm taking the parachute. Cheers. Right? Okay. Well, listen, my son, I'm a man of God, and I've lived a full and happy life. You may take the last parachute. No, don't worry, mate. We're gonna be fine. Really? What makes you so sure? That smartest man in the world guy, he just took my backpack. How's my son? He's going to be all right. Oh, oh. thank God. That's a great attitude. I gotta tell you, if I was getting this news, I don't know that I'd take it this well. But you said he was all right. Yes, he's lost his left hand, so he's going to be all right. You son of a... Get oh, this guy again. How is he, doctor? It uh, looks like he's dead. Oh, my God. Oh, little guy. The tears aren't coming. The tears just aren't coming. Uh, just to be clear, 
it looks like he's dead or he is dead? It just looks like he's dead. He's got, like, blue paint on him or something. But he's going to be fine. What is wrong with you? Doctor! Imagine instead of ages, it was levels. Like, I'm level 28. How cool is that? <laughs> Dude, my daughter died at level 4. Noob. Dad, can you help me write this love letter to Amy? Sure, what do you have? Dear Amy. Okay, how are you? I'm fine, just writing this letter to Amy. Right, how are you? Okay, how are you? Now what? Tell her what you did today. I mastered... Nope, nope, it. something else. Like what? Tell her where you went. I went pee at the gas station. No, I mean the movies. Oh, I went to the movies. What else? What did you see? A movie, dumbass, you just... Which movie, Derek? Sing 2, you was there. What Tell you... her, Derek. Oh, I saw Sing 2. Perfect. Anything else? You can add, I love you. Yep. My dad loves me. Perfect. She definitely gonna want to f me now. A little boy had a homework assignment where he had to find the difference between hypothetically and realistically, so he asked his dad. The dad said, well son, go ask your mom if she would sleep with the mailman for a million dollars. He went and asked his mom and came back and he said, mom said yes. The dad said, go ask your sister the same question. So he went and asked her and came back and he said, she said yes. The dad said, okay, now go ask your brother the same question. He went and asked and came back and he said, he said yes too. The dad said, well, hypothetically, we're sitting on $3 million. Realistically, we live with three whores. Guys, who wants to play uh, Two Truths, One Lie? <gasps> Ooh, me. What's that? It's basically where you tell your friends two truthful statements and one lie and they have to guess what the lie was. Uh, here, I'll go first. Michael, uh, my favorite food is pizza. I hate Game of Thrones and I love Fortnite. <sighs> Uh, the Fortnite one's a lie, because you hate Fortnite. Yeah, you got it. That one was too easy. Ooh, okay, my turn, my turn. All right, go. Uh, I hate anime. Sometimes I speak to myself for hours on end, and I'm the one who ran over Michael's cat. Well, obviously you didn't run over Michael's cat, so... Yeah. Ha! Wrong! Yes! Ah, uh, what a piece of cake. Too easy, guys. Jimmy, that's not okay. You ran over Michael's cat. <laughs> yeah, what the... Oh, 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 I got another one. Uh, no, I think we should stop now. Uh, really... I slept with your girlfriend. I poisoned your drink. And our old friend Sam didn't really go missing. He's actually buried in my backyard. Oh, wait, I did that wrong. Oh, thank God. All three of those were truths. <laughs> no, I really like this game. Dad, can I throw a party? Will there be drugs at this party? You already know. What you need? I got you. No drugs at the party. Right, no drugs at the party. What would, what would I say? I got Will there be alcohol? Well, it's a party, right? What's that mean? That there's not going to be any alcohol at this party. Are you inviting girls to the party? Yep, strippers. What? Strippers. Fully naked. I'm talking about cinnamon, candy, precious, diamond, Mercedes. No strippers at the party. All will not be here at my party. No hoes. How does hoes get on the guest list? I have no idea. As long as you follow my rules, you can have your party. Yes. Thank you so much. Hello? Hey Derek, it's Cinnamon. I'm with the other girls. I got the drugs and the alcohol. Did you know that if a basketball player and a bear had a fight, the basketball player would most likely lose? Hey mom, remember when you told me I'd learn everything I'd ever need to know in school? Yeah. Well, I never learned how to do taxes, what taxes are, how to manage money, anything about banking, how to grow food, how to handle rejection, how to love myself, how to handle interviews, how to buy my first home, how to survive in the wild, or how to handle myself in dangerous situations. But I sure am glad I know the Pythagorean theorem. Miss Johnson? What's wrong, Jimmy? Oh, nothing's wrong, but I saw you on the internet last night. The, the internet? <laughs> Where on the internet? How'd you get stuck in a washing machine? Jimmy, why, why were you looking at that video? How'd you get stuck in the washing machine, Miss Johnson? There was space. You could have backed out. J Jimmy, why were you watching that video? And then the dude who came to help you wasn't even helping, Miss Johnson. What was he doing? He just had to pull you out. Like, honestly, Miss Johnson, I'm not even going to lie. You look stupid. Like, you look You're stupid. You're only five years, years old. Why would you... Welcome to heaven, guys. To go inside, you have to get one question right. Okay. What four-letter word starts with the letter F and ends with the letter K? Um, fork? Correct. Go inside. Next. Hello. What is famous in movies and starts with the P and ends with the orn? Popcorn? That's it. Go inside. Next. Hey, what does every woman have that starts with a V and she can use it to get whatever she wants? Her voice. Correct. Go inside. Next. 
Um, what if we got all those wrong? You go to hell. Oh, great heavens! Why are you getting so many B plus, huh? Why can't you be like Steven, son, Bob? Only get the A plus plus. I'm sorry, Dad. I guess I'm just not feeling very motivated. Oh, motivation, huh? Motivation is a problem. Yeah, I think so. Okay, how about some ice cream? You want some ice cream? How you feel? I mean. It's good. You feel more motivation now. It's really good. Yeah. Very, very, Is it good? It's very, very, very good. It's a poison! What? <laughs> Finish page oh once to oh 1,748 oh oh or you die, dumb shit. Oh my god. You feel motivation yet? Is that enough motivation for you? You want motivation? Oh I give you motivation. Minecraft fun facts. It's well known that Minecraft's creeper was actually created by mistake, but it may surprise you to find out that you were too. Hey Siri, your mama's so fat, she sweats gravy. Your mom is so fat, a picture of her would fall off the wall. Your mom is so fat, she gets group insurance. Your mom is so fat, when she talks to herself, it's a long distance call. Your mom is so stupid, she got hit by a parked car. Wait, pause, there's something on your chin. No, there isn't. No, the third one down. You're so fat, your double chin has a double chin. That one was too far. Hey Siri, my dad left to get milk and he never came back. I'm so sorry. Can I cheer you up? Sure. Can you tell me a joke? Knock knock. Who's there? Not your dad. Ha ha. Alright, this is so fucking stupid. They're not even coming! Just sit there and wait, they'll be here soon! Oh. Easy for you to say! I have to stay alert the whole time while you just sit there and do nothing! Well, excuse me! I'm the one providing sun! You wouldn't be here for one for me! I'm basically your father! No. You're what? That doesn't even make any sense! Yeah, shut up! You're so annoying! Shut up, Lawnmower! You don't even do anything! Yeah! Oh, yeah? What happened last game? Both of your asses got eaten and I had to come save the day! Yeah, and I'm coming in for round two, but you'll Yeah, try it again. You literally got lucky last time! There's like four of Yo, you! Yo, guys, stop fighting! Shut up, Dave! Dad, our class had our award assembly today. Really? That was today? Did you get anything? Yes, I did. Did you get the English award? No, that was Randy Evans. Oh. Did you get the uh, math award? Nope, also Randy Evans. Did you get the history award? No, that was Heather in my class and also Randy Evans. Did you get the uh, reading award or is that also Randy, Randy Evans? Evans? Well, what did you get? I got detention for yelling, fuck Randy Evans, how did he get all these Hey son, so I just found out I have some free time this weekend, which means we have time to go on a camping trip if, if you'd like that. Oh, camping? I, I never really enjoyed those, to be honest. What? I never really liked those camping trips. Hey, hey no, wait, hold on, Dad. I, I didn't mean it like that, I swear. I really didn't mean it like hey, that. Hey, no, no, no. Hey, buddy. Buddy, it's fine. Is it though? Yes, seriously, seriously. I'm good. I'm really good. Okay, alright, alright. Oh my god. <laughs> Okay, I take it back. How can you say that? Oh, I'm having a stroke. Wanna hear a joke? No. Okay, here it goes. 500 bricks are on a plane. One falls off. How many are left? 499. How do you put an elephant in a fridge? You can't fit an elephant in a fridge. You open the door, put the elephant in, and close the door. <laughs> How do you put a giraffe in a fridge? Open the door, put the giraffe in, and close the door. No, you open the door, take the elephant out, and put the giraffe in, and close the door. The Lion King is having a party. All the animals are there except one. Which one? Let me guess, the lion. No, the giraffe, because she's on the fridge. Sally has to get across a river full of alligators. They are very dangerous, but she swims across safely. How? She steps on the alligator's mouth. Nope. The alligators are at the party. But Sally dies anyway. How? She drowned it? No, she got hit in the head by a flying brick. So this word is C, which means this word is seat, which means this word is seen. No, it's Sean. Why would you think? It's because it's a name. You don't, you don't see how. Okay. The word seen would be spelled like this, which means this word is... It'd be teen, which means this word is... Bean. No, it's been. Like, where have you been? Like, it's because it's like a verb, so it's not the same. It's like, different. Okay. That's why. You don't... You don't see how... Dude, I just realized that cowboys go yee-haw. And ninjas go he ya. Why are you the way you are? Bro, the letter W starts with a D. ATM fees is when you're just buying your own money. Mama, 
He's back. You know what's crazy? Water. It can boil you to death, freeze you to death, and drown you. Yet you still need it to survive. Stop! Hello? Hey, honey, it's me. Are you at the golf course? Yeah, why? I'm at the mall, and I love this Gucci dress. It's $10,000. Can I get it? Sure, if you really love it. Thank you. And I also stopped by the Tesla dealership, and I seen one I really, really liked. How much is it? $120,000. Okay, but for that, make sure it comes with all the cool options. Great. Oh, and one more thing. The house that I wanted last month is back in the market for $850,000. Well, then let's buy it and offer $950,000 so we'll know we'll actually get it first. Wow, you're the best, honey. I'm going to go do that right now. Love you. Of course, you're worth it. Does anyone know whose phone this belongs to? Oh, great heavens! Being a baby is so boring, bro. Like, all I do is poop and cry all day. What else am I supposed to be doing? Oh, there's my boy. Huh? Oh, snap. It's my dad. This is no Why does he have his hands on his head? Peekaboo. Hey, yo, am I tripping? Because I promised you was supposed to be. Peekaboo. <laughs> hey, that one kind of got me. Hey, Siri, tell me a Valentine's Day joke. What's the difference between you and a calendar? I don't know, what? A calendar has a date for Valentine's Day. Dude, why are deliveries on a ship called cargo, but in a car, it's called a shipment? Why? If one teacher can't teach all subjects, why is one child expected to study all subjects? Are oranges named oranges because oranges are orange? Or is orange named orange because oranges are orange. Did you seriously just say orange eight times in one sentence? Bro, what happens to the car if you press the brake and the accelerator at the same time? Does it take a screenshot? Dude, the youngest picture of you is also the oldest picture of you. If we have watermelon, shouldn't we also have fire melon, earth melon, and air melon? The Ella melons. Really? You, madam, are the most beautiful huh? gym that I have ever laid eyes upon. You both know. Would you do me the honor of being my bride? Uh, I don't know you. So yes? It's a, it's a no. Oh. It's a no. I don't, right. I don't know you, bro. It's a no. All right? I'm not doing that. I'm cool. I'm chilling. Hey, guys. I found a wig! Wait. Oh. Nah, nah. Nah, 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 nah. So how do you like to spend your free time? I like to sleep. <laughs> no, I mean when you're awake. Oh, I don't like that. Hey, wake up. You're free to go. What? Why? Somebody bailed you out. What? But I don't... I don't even know anyone. Who the fuck are you? Emmett? Okay, Emmett, did you... Bail me out of jail? Yeah. Well, why? I wanted to show you my hat. You bailed me out of jail because you wanted to show me your hat. Yeah, I just bought it. Wasn't my bail like $20,000? 25. So do you like no, it? No, not really. No. Fuck. Hey, son, what do you want for your birthday? Because I know you've been bullied a lot this year. Blood. But... Uh, what the fuck was that? I want blood. What the fucking hell are you on? I man? need it. Oh, you're so fucking weird. But, uh, but, 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 shut up, you freak. But the doctor said I need it to survive. Honey, get me my belt. Oh, this is the worst birthday ever. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O. You guys are always messing up. Seriously, it's L, M, N, O. Child, it's L, M, N, O. Right, we ride together, we die together. I don't know about that now. Go ahead, P. Don't go ahead, P, me. Y'all always grouping together. Y'all supposed to be individual. Ah, girl, I'm sorry, but we've been doing this for years. This is L, M, N, O. Y'all confusing the kid. Let them be confused. Y'all, it's L, M, N, O. Oh, my gosh. Can we play? Please just get along with the song. Shut up, because we really don't need you, Ed. Right. Every time somebody try to say a word that begin with you, they always say xylophone. <laughs> or x-ray. <laughs> I 
I know y'all ain't talking because I bet y'all all gonna say the same thing. Watch this. What's a word that begin with A? Apple. <laughs> I'm sorry, A. He got us there. All right, that's the only thing I can think of. <laughs> say what you have. Say it. <laughs> Alin. Oh, you're so bad you're at your evil. essence. That's why I did it. That's why I did it. Stop. Yeah, stop. Yeah. There's hell and hello. There's an end in friend. There's a lie in believe. There's an over in lover. And there's a good in goodbye. There's fun in funeral. Hey, excuse me. What's the fastest way to the hospital? Uh, close your eyes, cross the street. <laughs> Hello? Listen up. Tell him I said hi. I am the man who stole your son. Uh, the name is Derek, or you can call me Pretty Princess, I don't care. And, and I'm the man asking you to please come get him. I'm coming home, I'm coming home. Kid, Tell just give me one second. I'm coming home. Here's something else. I, it. I am blushing when you say that. Please stop touching me. Playing hard to get, he's playing. You are fucking because ridiculous, do you know that? Oh my gosh, handcuffs? Tell me we're gonna use the handcuffs. Just sit down. You sit down beside me. You are leaving. Just relax. Fine, I'll go. I know, you're leaving. Sir, can you come get him? Yeah, I oh my gosh. Not this song again. Stop touching me. Oh, we are not using that. That is a horrible name for a fruit. What if you just put the letter G at the start of the word? Oh, grape. I like it. Good name. Good name. Good name. All right, next one. Wait, um, grapes are fruit? Yeah. So we have grape, which is a fruit. Mm -hmm. uh, and then mm -hmm. we also have grapefruit, which is also a fruit. Yeah. Yeah. I don't see a problem with that. Me neither. Moving on. Uh, I was thinking the name for this one could be tomato. How about tomato? Put both down. Good Put idea. Down. That way it won't cause any arguments. Okay, next up, uh, what should we call this? Hmm. Hmm. I want to say orange. That's literally what I was thinking. Because of the colour? Because of the mm -hmm. colour, yeah. That's yeah, a really exactly. good name. That's I mean, really it's literally name. orange. Like, what, what exactly. Wrong there? I yeah. cannot see yeah. us regretting this. What about this one? Oh, it's the same colour. It's the same colour. Oh, Pointy orange? No. Orange, uh, orange with hair. Great. Long skip orange. Skip that one. Uh, yeah. Skip, skip. Carrot. Ooh, that um, could work. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That could work. Fuck that could it. work. Just put it down. Okay, I'll be right back. You guys get to know each other. Sure. So, how'd you guys become friends? Oh, it's actually kind of weird, but... Is it the spiders? The spiders? He has more spiders in his house than average. <laughs> What's average? 38. I haven't seen any spiders. You're not looking hard enough. I'm not really looking at all. Good. Do you like there being a lot of spiders? Yeah. And I don't like sharing. Okay, I'm back. Sorry. Hope that wasn't awkward. It was pretty awkward. Why? What happened? He said he only hangs out with you because there's more spiders than average in your house? No, he said that! Why would I say that? I already have all the spiders I need. See, what does that mean? Okay, man, if you want my spiders, you could have them. I don't! He does! He said he already has all he needs. I do. Why does he want a certain amount? This guy goes to see a psychiatrist. He says, Doc, I don't know what to do. My wife is being unfaithful to me. Every night, she leaves the house and she goes to Flanagan's bar and she picks up men. Apparently, she'll sleep with anybody that'll ask her to. I don't know what to do. What do you think I should do? And the doctor says, relax. Breathe. Calm down. Now, where exactly is Flanagan's bar? Gorilla walks into a bar, sits down, orders a scotch and soda. Bartender brings him the drink. Gorilla gives the bartender a $10 bill. As the bartender's walking to the cash register, he thinks to himself... He's a gorilla. He doesn't know the price of drinks. So the bartender gives the gorilla 15 cents change. Bartender says to the gorilla, you know, we don't get too many gorillas in here. And the gorilla says, yeah, at $9.85 a drink, I don't think I'm coming back either. So if this word is tomb, then this word would be... It would be boom? No, it's bomb. You don't see how... It's because the B and the T have different views on how, like, the word should be. Okay. Which means this word is... It'd be calm. No. So it would be cum. No, it's cum. You know, see how it's because like here, how about this one? So this word is Lim. Good, yes. I think you're starting to see how. And when we add a C, it's It'd be Clem. No, it's climb. You don't know, see how it's because it's like different. 
Like, the sea, like, took over the word, so, like, now, like, the word runs different. Like, that's why. Okay. Would you rather speak every language or be able to speak to every a speak every language? Could you imagine how hard? I got a wife and kids, man. You don't have I'm to so do sorry. this. I'm so sorry. Richard, I'm kill it. Just kill it already. Please, I swear I won't hurt you. It won't hurt you, I swear. And how do you know? Huh? It's not like you could speak to the thing. Yeah, well, uh, about that. A man was driving in the middle of nowhere when he got a flat tire. He came to a monk monastery. He asked the monk for refuge, and the monk let him stay the night. While he was asleep, he heard a noise. Not just any noise, but the most loudest, most wonderful, most beautiful noise he had ever heard. He wanted to see what it was, but there was just a giant locked door. He asked the monk what was behind the door, but the monk said, I can't tell you, you're not a monk. The next morning, he heard the noise again. He again asked the monk what it was, but the monk just replied, I can't tell you, you're not a monk. He said, how do I become a monk? The monk said, it is very hard and may take many years. But he had to know what was behind that door, so he agreed. For the next 50 years, he trained to be a monk. Finally, the monk gave him the key to the door, and he saw what was making that noise. But I, I can't tell you, you're not a monk. Nine one one. What is your emergency? Hey, um, my dad did. Y your dad is dead. Yep. O okay, so we need to send an ambulance. Mm. Sir, are you nodding right now? No, I can't uh, yeah, tell. Yeah, my bad. Yeah, come through. Yeah, come through. Jesus Christ. What? What happened? Somebody came through and put two holes in his chest. Shit, wild for real. Yo, what the? Two holes in his chest, sir. Are Are you okay? My throat kind of hurt. Sir, are you okay? Oh, yeah, I'm good, I'm good. Oh, my. My dad's not. Excuse me, doctor. My girlfriend's pregnant, but we always use protection, and the rubber has never broken, so what's going on? Let me tell you a story. There was once a hunter that always carried his gun wherever he went. One day, he picked up his umbrella instead of the gun by mistake. All of a sudden, a hungry lion jumped out in front of him. He pulled out his umbrella, used it as a gun, shot at the lion, and the lion died straight away. Now, come on, that's nonsense. Somebody else obviously shot the lion. Good, you understood the story. Next patient, please. So the reason why I'm getting a divorce, because when I woke up, it was my birthday. My wife didn't acknowledge my birthday. My son didn't acknowledge my birthday. I went to work. My co-workers didn't acknowledge my birthday. And my manager called me in and said, Mario. I said, fuck. I get in there and she said, happy birthday. I said, oh. Thanks. Then she said, you want to get some lunch? And I was like, okay. And then she was like, you want to go back to my place? And I was like, all right. So I went back to her place and she was like, let me step in my room. I'll be right back. She got back five minutes later and my kids, my coworkers, my wife, was all there to say happy birthday with a cake and I was on the couch butt naked. This guy gets a call from his buddy asking him to meet him at the bar. So the guy goes to the bar to meet his friend and they're sitting there and the guy looks at him and he says, look, I got two pieces of bad news for you. And the guy says, all right, well, combine them and tell me that way. And the guy says, all right, your girlfriend's cheating on both of us. Excuse me, sir. Is this your card? No, that's a piece of bread. Yeah, well, that's because the card's behind your ear. What the f fuck is going on here? Dad, I'm scared. You hear that? You're scaring my son. Yeah, well, he's about to be even more scared when I do this. Did you just turn my son into a slice of bread? Uh, uh no. He looks fine. That is the coolest shit I have ever seen. Yeah, it is. <laughs> and I'm not turning him back either. By the way, I'm Gordon Ramsay. Gordon Ramsay? Dude, I'm like your biggest fan. You're the reason I started doing magic. <laughs> Fucking disgusting. <gasps> Gordon, you can't say that about your son. God, you're so freaking cool. If you cut your leg off, are you your leg or the rest of your body? The rest of my body. Okay, now cut. All of your arms and legs off. Are you that pile or your body? I'm my body. Okay. You cut the body off. Are yeah. you the body or the head? I'm the head. You take your brain out. Are you the head or the brain? I'm the brain. You cut your brain to a million pieces. <laughs> you're, you're not, you're, what you're, are you, dog? I'm dead at that point. <laughs>
Lady's sitting at home when a phone rings. She looks down. It's her husband. She picks it up. Hello? Husband on the other line. Honey, I don't want to alarm you, but I got hit by a car when I was leaving work. Paula took me to the hospital. They checked me over. They did some x-rays. The blow to my head was pretty severe, but it didn't show any internal injury. Bad news is I got three broken ribs, a compound fracture in my left leg, and they might have to amputate my right leg. The wife says, who the fuck is Paula? So I'm not allowed to hold my sister's baby anymore because... The one time I held it, I dropped it. It, it wasn't even, okay, it wasn't even like a big deal. It was an accident, right? But then she starts screaming at me. She calls the cops. She says I did it on purpose, blah, blah, blah. All the while, of course, I'm denying it and stuff like that. But the real question is, who brings a baby to the Grand Canyon? You're late again. I know, I'm just, sorry. I'm just going through a messy divorce at the moment. You're not married. Wow, way to rub it in.